Welcome back, everybody, to some more of Tears of the Kingdom. Last time we left off, we got distracted with the Sky Islands up here. And we had a lot of fun. We found a nice little shrine here. And to begin the day, we're going to go fight Bucko over there. And we're going to see how it goes. He's got a chest on him. And, uh, yeah, let's let's get started. You know, I'm really close to the Great Plateau, but I'm also really close to that uh, Sky Tower right over there. Might get distracted and run over there. All right, so where's his weak point? Hello, Bucko. Oh, oh my god. Right there. What the? It's like doing no damage here. Oh, oh my god. Just, uh, kind of... Oh! Damn. It's like doing nothing. Oh, it's because I have a shitty-ass bow. Damn. Okay. Anytime he attacks like that, I need to, like, back up. So, because he, like, pauses for a bit. Like this, like this, like this. And then we'll go ahead and do this. Can I shock him? Okay. Back up, back up. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. That was good. That was good. We can get three shots off during that. Oh! He's pausing for the dicking. Can I run up? Oh my god, I can't. There we go. Oh, here we go. Here we go. That was good. That was good. So we can run up on him like that. Okay. Now what is this bullshit? I gotta, I gotta climb up. Maybe. So I gotta climb up on him. I gotta come on him. Oh wait, can I, can I use him as a platform? I can't. Oh shit! It sucks because the bow doesn't do that much damage. What the fuck? Holy crap! There we go. Climb up. Fuck. Here we go. Here we go. That's how we do it. And then it falls off. We got to run to it. There we go. And it's going to break on us. Okay. 18. That's fine. He's almost down. He's almost down. We almost got this. Hey, he turned into a cube. It's cube time. Okay. He's doing a bunch of weird shit now. Hey, shut up. Can I jump? No. Fuck. Come on, turn, you bastard. Right there. Let me put a drumstick on. See how you like that. No, no. Close. That was close. That was close. I'm getting too sloppy. Perfect. That was easy. And we got a bunch of shit that we can pick up here. An old map. Another one of these old maps. Still don't know what these do. That's okay. Oh, I see. Look at that. Okay. We'll see what this does. So it does light them. Where am I going? I didn't plan this out. Those are batteries. Oh, those are batteries before it runs my stuff out. Son of a bitch. <laughs> we'll be back for that Korok. We'll figure out what that needs to do. I want to go get that tower too. Because I'm, I'm like, I'm literally right here. Look at this. We made it. And what's in the chest? Another old map. What is, what are these, bro? Oh, shit. That's the electricity one. What is that? Look at that. Little star formation thing over there. Think I can make it over there? I, I kind of want to just go to that tower. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to ignore the Great Plateau. wonder if this is going to be like hard. East Gerudo Stai Archipelago. Oh, honestly? We could probably just fly over to here. Oh, I don't have stamina. Hell yeah. We made it. 
Is there anyone here that I can talk to? Or Okay, we made it. We'll go ahead and lock this shrine, and then... Hello? Hello? There's no power. For what reason? Sir, can you help me? That's a thunder guy. Oh! <laughs> Jonathan, you're back! Give me my shit and let me go. Hurry up! Yay! Ooh, hot weather attack. Okay, we gotta we gotta fast travel out of here. Oh, the Korok! That's what it was. Oh, okay. Nice. Oh, so I can just jump down in there? What the hell? That is horrifying. Oh, oh my god! What? What is happening? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! What? Oh fuck! That is amazing. That is amazing. I thought it was gonna be like one or two caves, not like a whole underground shit. Okay, I need to get my. I want to get these bulbs, bulbuses used up. Where are they at? Is it bright? Robbie told me to guide you to him once you arrived. I didn't bring enough bloom seed, so I lost sight of him. I thought he was taking a short walk over to that glowing area over there. Then he just kept going. Oh, and going west. Oh, I can throw them via hand. Okay, I can also attach them, but I don't want to waste them. This is so fucking cool. Oh, it's a light route? Okay, let's examine it. Let's see what this is. Is it going to light up the world because I have the power? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is some, like, next-level RPG shit, dude. So it did. It did light up the depths for us. And there's vegetation now. That's even cool. And I can fast travel. Oh, my God. Oh, that's, like, the map? The light route dispelled the darkness and brightened the surrounding area. Okay. Yeah. No, for sure. That's normal. Hey, you. It's really dark down here. Not one bit of light gets to the surface. Even my goggles I can hardly see. I really should have bought some bright bloom seeds with as one of the few light sources the glowing root growing down from above has piqued my curiosity. I'm not sure what it is, but it looks harmless enough. This place is roughly under the shrine on the surface. Off to the glowing root, I see shining west of here. You better hurry and get moving. Roughly on the surface. So is this like where the shrine is underneath? Oh, bomb fruit, bomb flower. Muddlebud, a wildflower with a powerful order that can disorient and confuse. So we're heading towards the other bud over there, and we can light that up. Deep Firefly, a multi-winged insect that lives in the depths. It excretes luminescent elements that can be cooked into elixir, which will add a faint glow to anyone who consumes it. And I guess down here is where I can pick up Muddlebud and Bombflower. Hey, you still alive? Look like this place is swimming in gloom. Get too close to that stuff and you're asking for trouble. If a guy didn't have any bright blooms, it would be curtains. Then again, it's my first time down here and I haven't kicked the bucket, so I'm sure you'll be fine. I've just spotted something of interest through my goggles. It's shaped like a figure Joshua wants. I'm gonna continue heading west towards one of those glowing roots I see ahead. See us soon. Oh, this is where we get the Zonites. Oh, look at that. Look at this guy. Yeah, this game is scary. <laughs> What the fuck? He just grabbed him. Okay. Oh, there's Robbie. Let's do this real quick. Light him up and then we can go talk to him. So she was saying that there might, there might have been like a civilization that lived underneath here, which I would like to learn. Was it the Zonai? But I thought the Zonai were from the sky. So is there another civilization that we don't know about? Or is it one and the same? Robbie, my guy. Oh, that's the statue. What does that look like to you? We'll go with frogs. Look at how bright that thing got. The light down in this dark is downright refreshing. In fact, it's so luminous, it's almost like like we're on the surface. Just standing there, it makes me feel much better. So that's probably what we're going to have to do is light all of this up um, to weaken Ganon, maybe? Or to at least get rid of the gloom. Hey, it's you. You're finally here. I need to show you what I've found. It's a statue, of course. This statue is standing tall on two legs one arm raised high it looks an awful lot like the figure josh has showed us on that piece of slate don't you think so is the camera going to function the same like last time we have to take pictures of everything your camera is locked and so was hyrule compendium oh god another minigame <laughs> oh son of a bitch yeah oh 
Get away from me! <laughs> These are post spirits! They're not like actual uh, enemies. They just drop? Oh, wow. The fuck? What the fuck is that? That... Guys, what the hell? It's a regular sword. It's not broken. They're, they're giving me non-decayed weapons. Hey, girl. We're back with your stuff. Show Joshua the picture you took. Yes, here's my pic. I took it with my camera. 4K, of course. Hell yeah. A big, big discovery. What are you going to give me? Ah, oh, Zonites. Okay, let's go see how much a Zonite new battery cell costs. Oh, okay. Hatino Village. I'm going to update our, our shit. So what are you going to give me? So this is the Poe guy. You who stand before me. I am one who returned Poe to the afterlife where they belong. Offer Poe to me. They are spirits that ought to return to the afterlife. Here's a Poe. What a pitiful beings they are. They have lost their way home and wandered the depths of this land. I returned the lost spirit to the afterlife where it belongs. Since I brought here to the surface, I have I have been unable to return the post to the afterlife. Because of you, I can assist them once again. Take this. Yeah, a dark clump. An unusual substance. It's cold to the touch, and it seems to be filled with pitch blast darkness. Use it in cooking to get a gloom resistant effect. Oh, a dark tunic. I need 150. I need 150. And then I could get... I, I could get bombs. Yeah, but uh, obviously we want this. Of course I want this. Of course I want. Other than that, you just get bomb flowers, puff shrooms, which is good. I can, if I get a bunch of Poe stuff, I can go get bomb flowers. I will tell you the location of one of my brethren. Oh, there might be more of these guys that might offer different stuff. Should I waste the Poe souls and see? So far, this game has just exceeded my expectations. Oh, shit. Hyrule Castle, Moat, East, Chasm. Oh. Yeah. Uh-oh. What the hell is that? What the fuck? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh. What is happening? What is happening? go here we go we got this not what i expected to be doing oh shit no that is insane that is insane oh the three times fuck <laughs> oh my god i gotta take a bit <laughs> look at him he's so cute oh my god look at him look at his little face I gotta run! <laughs> so far, they are fucking us. They are fucking us with the amount of different enemies in here. What the fuck? Fashion forward. There once was a legendary bandit by the name of Misko, but theory is what made them a legend. Their unparalleled fashion sense. Oh my god. I thought that might strike your fancy now. Do you have a map? Of course I have a fucking map, bitch. Who do you think I am? I'm the top dog in this bitch. A piece of the fairy wild outfit from Misko's collection said to fill the wearer with power is around here. There's more. Oh my god, this is so much. Yo! A piece of very snappy outfit from Misko to keep you safe and lightning is around here, okay? So I gotta like find her. Do you know about the great fairies? Yeah, I know about the great fairies. I think one of them was seen around Woodland Stable in the east. Woodland Stables. I don't have a I don't have a Woodland Stable yet. Let's let's go see what this is about. Let's open this up. First treasure down. Oh, it's barbarian armor. Attack up. Okay, and with that, that's where we're going to end today's episode. I know we get distracted a lot, and that's more than fine, because that's the whole point of the game. The next time we come back, we're going to go check out what the hell I pinned over here, and what the hell I pinned over here. And then we're going to go to Nakluda, hopefully. Thank you guys for watching. I hope to see you next one. Bye-bye. Me deep throwing TikTok.